This is the best job I've ever had, by far. My first job, I worked at KFC. I worked at KFC for three weeks, which is the longest anyone has ever worked at a KFC. <laughs> I have a pension. <laughs> what you're supposed to do when someone walks into a KFC is say, can I help you? The KFC that I worked at was in New York City's Penn Station, and I worked the 1 a.m. to 8 a.m. shift. The 1 a.m. to 8 a.m. shift. At a fast food restaurant in New York City at one o'clock in the morning, can I help you is not good customer service. <laughs> it's a promise you can't keep. <laughs> I never minded sad people, by the way. You should be sad. It's a KFC. The people I minded were like, Young white hipsters who would come in like it was a real restaurant. They'd say things like, hmm. And they'd be like, what's your healthy option? And I'd be like, leaving. That's our healthy option. <laughs> By the way, that's why I love, like, growing up in Boston, there's this place called Dunkin' Donuts. And I love Dunkin' Donuts. You know why? Because they know it's bad. <laughs> No one pretends. They don't make the employees pretend. You walk into a Dunkin' Donuts, they're like, hi! <laughs> Welcome to Dunkin'! <laughs> <laughs> what food would you like to eat? <laughs> and you're gross, because you're at a Dunkin' Donuts. You're like, can I have 50 donut holes for $9? And they're like, yeah, do you want a Diet Coke with that? It is breakfast. <laughs> oh, it's so great. You're the same as the employees who work at Dunkin' Donuts. The customers are the same as the employees. You're unhappy, they're unhappy. You're gross, they're gross. You're not wearing gloves, they're not wearing gloves. <laughs> 